What's going on? The Shadow 2088 here. I'm back with another AFK Arena, and this time I've decided to go back and actually start from the beginning in a new server. So, you, to give you an idea, and hopefully, you know, some of these tips and tricks that I learned from either myself on playing gameplay, but majority of it, honestly, I've learned it from other YouTubers. So, we'll get into it right now. I'll, well, right now, this is just a tutorial, so. Of course, we're going to go ahead and tap to begin. You and get the two out, and then let's get the battle going. But it is a slow... Okay, yes, right, I forgot. <laughs> okay, well, you know, there, there are champions that you do get along the way. By completing, you unlock My certain flick. heroes again. Okay, let's tap on her to get her story, and then let's go ahead and collect those gems. So in case you didn't know about doing that, make sure you always do that. That way you don't lose out on anything. But hold on, let me hurry and get through the tutorial. I am the heir of ash and fire. Okay. the rewards and then we level up so we get more gems it's not bad it's pretty interesting to see you know how we started from the beginning okay so let's see how what was I gonna do right let's go ahead and claim some of these right. let's go ahead and get all that up again okay now from what I've learned from the tip is that um Okay, for heroes, from what I've learned, and I made the mistake, but I'm still not going to give up my primary. I worked so hard to get Ezio. I do not want to go <laughs> and lose him. So I don't mind on a new server. But anyway, tip number one from what I've learned is that you pick a team, depending on what team you run or what preferred hero you want to run, stick with it. Do not trade it out do not ascend it immediately which i'll explain maybe if i can get to the ascension tower if not won't be able to explain until later on but i'm going to show you the banners on the por portrait so here are the banners for it so these ascended tier heroes can go beyond and can go higher levels these ones um uh, for the pro tip do not ascend these so let's say i got um, May the light protect Belinda. And I could ascend her, let's say, to a legendary plus tier. I shall end from your suffering. A legendary plus tier to a mythic tier. Um it would be best not to do it. So let's Let say for light. her if I want to get her to a mythic and I have It's hunting time. Fox at a um legendary plus tier. Ashes to ashes. If I had Linda ready to go and I had him to offer it would be best not to do it I'm sorry I, I, it was my cat <laughs> if you hear that slight sneezy background it's my cat I don't know what happened to it oh well, I don't know what I think she's I hope not but I hope she's okay <laughs> Uh, anyway, uh, lost train of thought, but yes, do not ascend them. And uh, the recommendation to do the ascending is probably from down here, these legendary tiers. These legendary tiers can only go up to legendary plus tiers. Their maximum level cap is going to be 140. After that, they don't go any higher. So it would be best to use them, especially if you get them to um, a lower tier. Uh, I forgot. Honestly, I don't remember the the purple tier. <laughs> but you start leveling them up in that plus tier version. Uh, when you ascend them, so let's say I want Belinda, and I have Hogan at the legendary plus tier, I could give up Hogan in order to up in Belinda up more. So that's the only way to do it. Or uh, again, any of them like um, and the Lightbringers. Oh. Like Cecilia at a um the purple plus uh, tier. 
I shall cleanse evil. Mythic. There you go. I got it. Mythic. For my Mythic Plus, you could use the Legendary Mythics. When they're at a Mythic Plus, use them. Use them. But some of these myth uh, Legendary Tier Heroes can help you get higher. So that was a thing I made a mistake. So don't underestimate these guys as well. For the common tiers, I don't really see a, a really good point of them helping you other than them helping you get more Barrett coins. So that will be more on that later. So for now, the, that's what I can give you off on that one. And then make sure you find the right hero you want to excel, whatever you want to use mostly, and whatever team you want to use. You know, go ahead and do that. So for now, let's go ahead and progress a little further, see if we can get into it faster. But yeah, I can't go two times soon until I get to past chapter two, so this is going to be a slow video. I'm going to go ahead and go up past chapter one at least, I think. And get rid of the other tiers. I know they drop chests. I don't really see that as often as I would. Excuse me. What I kill, Jay. Alright, cool. Another one. Oh yes, that's right. So you can do it this way to get your to get the story and to get your gems. Okay. So we have her. You. you can level them up, equip the gear, and then we're back. Oh man, I forgot to show you guys. Alrighty. I'm coming for you. So now we have um two warriors, a sorcerer, and a um, Kinda like a hunter, but I think it was a lightweight. Uh, I really need to start this game. You know, I have been playing this since sometime around April or May since Ezio was announced, but I've been going pretty good and been patient with the game so far. Okay, so it's telling me that the tutorial is good and ready, so I can stop. Okay, let's go ahead and breed him to a five. Okay, Ash Muriel, fire. Muriel up to a 5 as well. Oops, sorry. Connection's a bit slow, a so give me on that one. <laughs> I'm coming for you. And, well, I only do it at a 5 at least, so that way they all have a good fighting chance. You and dare have some stand gear. against me. So I'll give that them. I am the heir of Ash and Fire. Even still, it wouldn't hurt even though he's just a common. But anyway, another way you can do it too is like, uh, whoops. I, I am the heir of Ash and you Fire. Him, see his story. Me. You go here, and you open the book, and then up on the top right, you can put the, the gems. But the thing is, you can't do it for, for the commons, so... Plus, with the common heroes, I wouldn't really recommend leveling them up. I don't think there would be a point. But I'll understand at least the, um, the legendary and mostly the ascendant. But if you have the hero that you want to use, like from the Ascendant tier, I would recommend excelling them as fast as you can in high levels and then start working your way up on getting the other ones. But for now, just go ahead and keep doing that. Oh, yes, and let's not forget to claim. And, oh yeah, that's right, I forgot the Destiny's Tree. Um, I'm going to leave this one up for debate. Um, please comment who should I collect, either the Credia. I think I butchered that name so badly. Lucretia or Zephyril? One of the two. All of it on my main account, I did collect Zephyril, but this one, I want to make this one about us. So please leave a comment to see what I um, should get, and the one with the most comment on who I should get, I'll go ahead and get. So for now, I'll leave this up like this. I won't claim. Yes, that's right. I forgot I have those completed, so I have more done. So let's continue. Right, I have more, and it's still manageable. I don't need to worry. Oh, wow. I forgot how <laughs> slow this was. When I first started, I thought it was pretty quick. I thought it wasn't too bad, but now that I think about it, it's so bad. <laughs> I think you still get those automatically. I'm not too sure. Um, I'm pretty sure everyone knows this, but if you're new to it and you lose your hero, don't worry. They automatically recover health, and you continue. Like I said, I got that. Uh, keep collecting as much as you can. I won't be able to get here until I get to... Okay, I passed the whole thing. So, 
for the time being, I'm stuck on this whole tutorial level. I'll go ahead and compl uh, complete this, and then after that, I'll see what you guys think of um, me starting over and giving you guys an idea. I'll go more in depth and detail once I get past everything. But for now, we'll, we'll just go on this slow, tedious journey and go ahead and collect most of the stuff. So you see, I lost um, my common. But he'll be coming back. And everyone else that's wounded will so come back with full health, which is good. I didn't realize that until then. So we're already at that point where. Okay. So we equip some gear. And then we'll go ahead and level up Hogan. We'll put him up to a 10 at least. Okay. And then. I am the heir of Ash and Fire. We'll go here up to a 10 as well. You know what? Let's go ahead and get them all to attend. That'd be fine. And then let's see. Okay, yeah, that'd be fine. Yeah, so even though he's a 1, it, it's okay. But if I do get the <laughs> block and killed right off the, the gate from here, then yeah, maybe it would be fine. But I think it should still be fine regardless of that level. Now. See, like, doing okay, doing pretty good. Let's just hope my RNG pulls for the summonings in here are really good compared to my main account. That way, you know, I could show you guys more fluent way of getting past and going up. But the thing is, too, even down to some of the comments for um, in that world chat, is that there are a lot of them were complaining about how the fact that you know they were stuck all the time. But from what I was told, especially down to it from experience, is you will be roadblock, and you will be slowed, but just because all that happens doesn't mean you should get frustrated and impatient with the game. The game is made to be patient. So, patience and a whole lot of luck, because, you know, trust me, it does happen like that. Okay, so now we're at world 1-9. Ooh, you know what? Okay, we'll get Hogan up first to uh, higher, so he can do a little bit more. I'm at a 15 for now. I am the we have heir more of Ash gear, which we'll equip, and then we'll put her up higher as well. Okay, so that will work. That'll be fine. It's okay, see? Even though, you know, I'm coming my Ira is at a, at a 10, it'll still be fine. Hogan's up there in the front line, along with uh, the other guy down in the bottom. And... I think Tony don't really get the bonus actually, um, what do I call it? Bonus from up here. That's the thing too. So I have three Lightbringers that are together in a team, so I think it only works with um, Legendary and Ascend tier. So, oh yeah, let's not forget that. And then, we'll continue. Yeah, let's see, like, right here. Um, the more teams you have of the same faction, the higher, you know, your stats become. So since I have three... Oh, wait, no, that is stupid. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, I do have three. I forgot. That include the common. I have three light, um, light bringers and only one wood woodland. So that puts me with my teams all... Let's see. Increases the stats of all allied heroes with the... When three heroes of the same faction are used together, so basically everybody in my team get gets an additional plus 10% attack and HP, so it goes on from there. And just like this whole team on this site, which are all hypergen, they all get an increase. So basically, they all get an additional. I don't think they get the top ones because they're not highlighted, but they do get the bottom ones, which they do get in the diff uh, plus 30% defense. Plus energy recover when injured, 25%. A quit, uh, crit rating of 15% plus, and a 30% critical strike damage plus, and a 15% uh, 15 haste, which is pretty pretty outstanding. But I'm still working on these guys, so it'll be fine. Well, I, <laughs> I forgot not really. I know I said that before. I know how slow. I'm going to much of the whole thing is. But at the same time, they're you know, the combat, you know, it's not too bad. I didn't realize. But I prefer to still play it at a higher speed just to progress further. So 
if this is too slow for you guys, you know, once I get past it, let me know. I'll go ahead and increase the speed to two times. Uh, I don't have this on PC, and I don't have a computer or laptop to do that for. But I've seen some of them play on the uh, for other YouTubers. I don't. You know, their their times two can go up to a times four, so they can actually speak fast without having to be slow. And that's the thing that uh, I was kind of curious. So right now, you know, of course, obviously, I'm playing on a mobile, <laughs> and it, you know, I still enjoy it. I don't really care what platform we play on. As far as the whole concept thing goes, I, it don't really matter. As long as you enjoy it, there are preference. And I'll admit, I do have those two, but I'm I don't want to go into detail you. with that. But anyway. Hmm. They'll never see me coming. Let's go ahead and get what I now. kill. Go up to a fist hey. And then let's put you everything into Hogan. Because he's the one that, in the front line for the majority of the stuff, so let's go ahead and have him do this. <clears throat> oh yeah, that's right, huh? I don't know if I remember you do fight this boss, but I know you do get him to fight him again later on. I don't remember if I was the night time for the lights. <laughs> After uh, it's April to uh, May and October, but again, I won't go into details of the time I'm off there. So for now, we are for a fight. Okay, I finished the chapter. We'll go ahead and claim those rewards. Alright, cool. I got level up, and then now I have a chance to do those. Mm, let's see. But let's just go ahead and go to the next chapter so that way we can kind of speed the battle up a little. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we go here. I'm not sure if you guys want to pause to read these, but you can still go ahead and read them even though you're in the new area. Like for now. Okay, so now I can go here and go to the mobile tower. Now, in this one, this is where it Trust comes down to. Oh, excuse me. Alright, um. New Hero Ganshi. Okay, cool. So I can yeah, use that scroll I got. So, click on to get the new hero, which is going to be a purple, and I get... Whoa! Hello! Get Shimira right out the rip, finally! Wow, that's not bad! Okay, that's actually, you know, that's pretty cool. I don't remember who I got before. And, okay, we back out, we go through all that. But let's still go ahead and click that. And then we get... Okay, so now the gems, they're, I'm at 2140, so that another tip for this too is the fact that it would be best to try and save up to get 10, and really knock out these as much as you can. And these are special scrolls that you can get, or fraction scrolls, but you can only get them through certain events. And you can get, um... We'll call them friendship hearts. That's what they are. When you have friends, the more friends you have on here, I think the max you can only get is 30. But it would be, again, another way Even I would recommend sevens. is if you can try Even to get 10. Heroes. That way you get la, better la, odds. La. And sorry, Dolly, but I prefer Markiplier and this one, so we'll change them to Markiplier. Now the Wish. I'll go ahead and fix that. It'll be another time to do that. That's why I won't really be doing any summonings. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so we're back here. Alright, so let's get her up. So now, we have a... Uh, uh, Shimira. And see, this is an elite. These elites are really good. And preferably, it would be best to level them up as much as you can. And max them up, so that way you get more of the... Uh, you know, what you're trying to go for. Especially since now, since I have a Graveborn. I'll probably do a hybrid of Light... Lightbringers and Greyborns, but we'll see how that goes. And I'll go ahead and get rid of her gear and go ahead and give them to Shimura, which will be fine because I want to excel her now since I pulled her. And then 
we'll go ahead and put on a team. And I know placement is one of the things key, but for now, this is not too crucial. But we will put him like that so Hogan can still defend her, and then we'll go. Now that I'm here, oh man, okay, so we have to get past Cup of Tea. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, it would be interesting to see the fights in detail and see how they actually look at the animations and everything. Oh, cool. 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 Alrighty. So it's not bad, I enjoy it. So we can level up. Okay, and then the fast rewards. Uh, it helps you retain them and you only get them on a daily basis and for my time they reset every time around six o'clock in the evening so it would be best to do it once for free you do get more rewards but the next time you use it it costs 50 gems uh, depending on the situation you know you can just use it once at least and then get it <clears throat> but the challenges do sometimes tell you to collect loot twice from it So I can do that. Actually, hold on. Okay, I require more. All right. Oops, sorry. See, I have 2150. And it's not a deal breaker if I do it again. So I'll go ahead and do it again. So I get more. I get that, and then see, so I get that, and I get 10, 10 more, and I can get the uh, second chest, which will give me 100 gem, 100 diamonds. And what am I calling gem? I have too much smite in my mind. <laughs> But 100 diamonds, and then you get the arcane scroll. So, I'll do that later, later on. Okay, I have all that done. I am the heir okay, of so Ash and Fire. Even still, I don't want her to die too fast. We'll equip the gear. And then we'll get Shimura up. So, we'll put her up to one. And then keep going. Alright, so I have that kept off. Okay, next we'll go ahead and bring up Hogan. Oh, I can't bring, in, can't bring up Hogan. Okay, it's fine. So, we're going to do a couple more. I just can't do much with that. Ouch. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, let's see how much time we're going to do. That's still it's not bad. I enjoy it. That's cool. Alright, and we'll... Excuse me. Okay, collect that. Uh, this one is best to collect on a daily, so... When you're not really playing the game and you're actually... Like how the game suggests is AFK, you get, um... Accumulated equipment, goal, EXP, and, um... EXP for your heroes. So for now we'll go ahead and claim it. Get that out of the way. <clears throat> we'll get up to the second boss at least. Or you know what? At least we'll get past this one. Maybe up to the second first boss. Second chapter of the first boss. And then we'll stop it from there. Get okay, it. There we go. Alright, and now we got ten you see ten diamonds is not bad. Now we're up for second boss fight. Hmm. I think this will still be fine. It should be fine. So let's go for it. Oh, I got her name. I see the spirits. I spirits. Amen. We got it all paid again. Alright, cool. Now, try and keep those collected on a really good daily basis. And it looks like I can go ahead and do the Dark Force. So I can go ahead and go here. And go through the Labyrinth. So the goal here is generally get them from down here all the way to the top. Up here. And doing it three times. There's only three floors. And if you can excel that. Which this one I'll do in another time and explain more into it, but for now I'm going to go ahead and end the gameplay right here. Again, if you guys really do enjoy this, please leave a like, subscribe, and the more views it gets, you know, 
I will continue to do more and then try to catch up to my original progress. But for now, I'll go ahead and end it right here. And again, for the Destiny's Choice, you know, like I said, please leave a comment on who I should get. So for now, I'm going to end it right here. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you're accumulating the knowledge. I'll go ahead and get the YouTubers' names, accounts down, so that way you guys can go ahead and check them out. I highly recommend it. They're really informal. They'll help you get where you need to go, and they will help you out as much as they can with what they know. And they have really good intel information on the game, so like I said, I highly recommend it. So again, I hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like, subscribe comment and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.